Good morning. Thanks for starting your day with us here on Denver 7 News. I'm Jessica Crawford and I'm Jason Grenauer. Here are the stories you should know about before you head out the door this morning. We start with some breaking news overnight. Arvada police are investigating a shooting involving an officer. It happened in a neighborhood just east of Wadsworth on West 61st Avenue. One person was taken to a nearby hospital. No officers were injured. Arvada police say there is no safety risk at this time to the community. You'll soon pay more for deliveries in Colorado. Several new fees passed by Colorado lawmakers last year go into effect on Friday. For Amazon, UPS, and DoorDash, Coloradans will pay an extra 27 cents. There's also an extra 30 cent fee for Uber and Lyft rides. The money will go towards expanding public transportation along with bridge and road repairs. Today is election day across Colorado. There are a few things that voters need to know as you head to the polls for primary day. For one, it is too late to mail in your ballot. You can fill it out and drop it off at a polling place before 7 p.m. today. Many counties will allow you to track your ballot online to see if it's been processed. And of course, you can also vote the, vote the old fashioned way that's in person. Polls are open today from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. And now here's meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo with your Denver 7 forecast. And it's going to be a beautiful day. Skies really clearing out across the state today. Lots of sunshine expected this morning and it'll be a little bit warmer than yesterday. We hit highs in the mid to upper 80s yesterday. Today it's going to be 90s for most of the metro area. You're stepping out the door though to 50s this morning and we'll quickly climb. Take a look at our hourly planner by about oh, 9 to 10 o'clock already in the mid 70s to near 80 degrees by mid morning. So highs today are going to be right around 90 to about 90. 95 for northeastern Colorado. More 70s in the mountains today. Uh, dry, hot today. We'll see a better chance for some afternoon thunderstorms on Thursday.